गुड इवनिंग इन टूडे सेशन लेट्स डिस्कस रिगार्डिंग नेशनल ऑटोमेटेड फिंगरप्रिंट आइडेंटिफिकेशन सिस्टम आई रिपीट नेशनल ऑटोमेटेड फिंगरप्रिंट आइडेंटिफिकेशन सिस्टम दिस इज अ मेकानिज्म दैट वर्क्स थ्रू ए सॉफ्टवेयर दिस विल हेल्प द पुलिस अथॉरिटीज टू आइडेंटिफाई द कल्प्रिट इमीडिएटली एंड दिस इज अ मेकानिज्म थ्रू विच the database is maintained and from this database the suspect's fingerprints and the palm can be matched and the culprit can be identified very very easily and the central government is planning to establish these centers throughout the country meaning every state is going to have this mechanism so that identification of the criminals will become much easier they can be caught very early and they can be convicted and they can be punished so this is the this is how this mechanism is going to work regarding this i have the information i would like to share the information with you kindly have a look at this one look at this the topic is national automated fingerprint identification system kindly remember this one this is designed to help in quick and easy disposal of the cases with the help of a centralized fingerprint database very 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 important one and another important point for the examination point of view is that which is the first state in the country which is the first state in the country to identify a deceased individual through this particular identification system very 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 important one this is madhya pradesh it happened in the year 2022 it happened in the month of april and madhya pradesh became the first state in the country to identify a deceased individual through national automated fingerprint identification system very 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 important one and this identification led to the registration of homicide case that is based on circumstantial clues very 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 important one and in future it will become very difficult for the criminals to perform a crime and run away and the system is being made full Uh, full proof and the entire data is maintained at one place that will become easy for the authorities to identify the culprits catch them and punish them at the earliest that is the biggest advantage clear and and lots of database is going to be maintained and for each for each criminal a 10 digit identification is going to be given that is called id number and that is the common that is a unique id that is provided to each criminal and their complete their complete you know data will be maintained at the centralized database that will be connected to various other centers that are located in different parts of the country this is the biggest advantage and whenever such technology is there in the news and whenever something is related to the you know the uh, crimes and it's always important for the examination please remember all these things all these points very very important one and probably most probably the question may be which is the first state in the country to identify a deceased individual through national automated fingerprint identification system and your answer should be madhya pradesh very 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 important one and that's all for the day i'll see you in the next session with more current affairs thank you so much